Hey YouTube, it's Trevor. It's been like a year since I've posted a video. Um, I'm posting a video because Taylor asked to see what was in our medicine cabinets um, in our bathrooms, which is pretty awesome. So I will get to that later. Um, I also realize it's been a year. Um, last time I talked to you, I was living in Calgary. Um, no longer in Calgary. I'm living in Vancouver. Uh, it's a lot warmer here in the winter time, and a lot, uh, I don't know, better in the summer. I live like a block and a half from the beach, from the ocean, which would be that way. Uh, yeah, yeah, that way. It's pretty awesome. Um, I go to the beach as often as I can when I'm not working or going to school. Um, but I figured I would take you on a little bit of a tour of my apartment. It's just me and my roommate. Um, it's a one bedroom. I have the bedroom for now. And she has a living room, but we're going to move to a two-bedroom in August. So, some things in my bedroom. Um, you guys might get to see exactly what kind of a dork I am. I have a toy collection. 98% of it is wind-up toys. I'm extremely addicted to wind-up toys, so if anybody ever wanted to get me anything, wind-up toys is that, or little Lego things. Um, so, this is it here. My little... These are all my toys. This is my little Mater from Cars 2. Um, Lego figurine. And then all my wind up toys. My McDonald's Batman toys. Um, pictures of my mom and my sisters right there. Uh, yeah. It's pretty cute. Um, what else do I have? I have my Cape Breton flag. That's where my family's from. That's right, from the East Coast. Well, I'm technically not, but most of my family is from out there. With my pride buttons right here. I don't know if you can see them. It's kind of dark lighting in my room sucks. It's a very messy nightstand with my book. And my handheld Nintendo. My bed with all my stuffies. It's also not very exciting pretty boring since I moved here. Uh, what else? Um, here's about the biggest, dorkiest thing you guys are going to think I have, but I don't care. I am a Bieber fan. I know. I know it's bad. It's very bad, but I like him. So I found a holographic Bieber poster. Yeah, that's right. Holographic. I know you guys are jealous. And if you move it, he moves. Changes, yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> Sorry guys, you didn't really have to see that. Um, what else? I have my wall of friend stuff. People send me letters and cards and pictures and stuff, so I put them up on my wall to remind me on the days that I'm sad that there's people in this world that care about me. Um, it's my donkey. Eating a waffle, hanging from my ceiling, just chilling out. Johnny Depp. Uh, what else? Oh, in the corner, I have posters that I'm going to put up in my new room, which you guys will see, and my guitar. I work for Cineplex, so I get a lot of free movies and shit like that. I'll show you my kitchen. It's a little bit messy, because I just did dishes, but, uh... This is my little kitchen. My stove. I ate pizza tonight. Pizza's good. So, my living room. My roommate's bed is behind this couch, so I'm not going to show you. And I'm watching The Voice. Love this show. Love it. Um, let's see. What else? I have a Wii. I don't know. Let me try and turn on some light. It's very dark. Aha. That's better. So I have my Wii. It's red. All my Wii games. And Wii accessories and whatnot. And another poster there from work. And yeah. It's my roommate's bike. And all our boxes because we're moving. I'll take you into the bathroom. Hang on, I, probably, I have a pretty epic bathroom. 
Oh, there you go. I have an epic bathroom. It's uh, M&M's, not the wrapper, the candy themed. We have that. We have circle mats on the floor. We have the soap dish and that soap there. And these things. This is mine. It's cool. Put your toothbrush in it. Oh, pretty awesome. And my medicine cabinet. So this is my shelf. The other two shelves are for my roommate, because girls get new roommates, but I have my razor, my shaving cream, toothpaste, my Planet 51 toothbrush drink cup thing, my flossers, because they're super cute, hair product. Yeah, not very exciting. Um, sorry, I just got really dark because I turned the light off. What else to tell you guys? I... Let's see. I've been really sick. Um, I know last year I posted saying my health was doing pretty good. Um, I did get diagnosed... It's a few months ago now. Um, with a tumor on my spine. So... It's kind of... Touch and go. Um, I'm doing pretty good. I was in the hospital for the entire month of... April, which meant spending my birthday in there. Um, not sure if it was tumor related or what, um, but I was in there. I couldn't eat, couldn't drink anything. They had like a tube down my nose. It was pretty bad, pretty disgusting. Um, what else? Uh, school's going good. It wrapped up for the summer. I'm working lots. Um, like I said, I work for a movie theater. It's pretty awesome. Free movies. Right now, I think we have like Pirates of the Caribbean playing and Green Lantern. Transformers comes out soon, so it's been pretty busy at work. Um, what else do I got to tell you guys? Um, not really seeing anybody right now. There's a few, well, a couple interests that I have, but I don't know if they're really going to go anywhere. I hope they do, but um, I'm kind of complicated when it comes to love and all that stuff. I'm not really into committing to anybody that's like already in a relationship. Don't really do the poly stuff very well. Did it before. Got my heart destroyed. You know, long story. Uh, what else is pretty cool? Uh, I don't know. I just want to say hi to Taylor. That's why I'm really making this video because he asked to see what was in my medicine cabinet. And what else? This box here, Taylor. It's not a camera. But it is a parcel for you that I'm going to send on Friday, I hope. Um, our post office in Canada is on strike, so which really blows because I've been trying to resend this parcel for a couple weeks now. And the post office has been on strike, so hopefully I'll be able to send it Friday or... I have to ask and see how long, like, whether or not they're just going to hold it in there for a couple weeks or if they're actually going to let me send it to you. But that's yours. And, uh, what else? You guys want to see some baby pictures of me? Um, for those of you, if you're just tuning in now, um, and haven't followed me from the beginning, I'm trans. So I mean, female to male. So these baby pictures are, obviously, of me. I don't know kind of mother would put their kid in dresses when they're just a baby, especially their son, hey? Um, but I was cute baby, so we'll take a look at them. So there's me there. Uh, I don't think I would ever put my kid in a dress like that, though, whether they were a girl or a boy. And some more baby pictures there. I was pretty cute. Me there. That's my Auntie Joyce and me when I was, I think I was probably like three or four there, I don't remember. And then, there's my mom, stepmom and my dad and me. Probably shouldn't show those ones to my mom. She'd kill me, so I'm not going to put those on YouTube. And then just some more here. Of me as a baby. Yeah. I was a pretty cute kid. Anyways, that's all I got for now. Um, I'm going to try and make an effort to upload as much as I can over the summer. I'd like to make some stuff for you guys at the beach, um, as well as maybe some trips I take this summer, going camping, 
Um, oh, I guess I should, like, I don't know. It's been a while. I guess I could do a chest surgery update. Um, hopefully you guys will be able to see it. Um, but it's been over a year since my chest surgery. And it's healed up pretty nicely. Let me just cover my belly. Sorry, guys. So this is what it looks like now. It's not bad. Got a little bit of belly hair going on. Not so much chest hair. Um, but I do have a fair amount of belly hair. Which is pretty cool. But I know I'm extremely happy with my chest. The nipples are still on, which is a big thing. So, yeah. Um, if you guys want to know anything, if I left anything out that you guys are wondering or want updates on, let me know. Ask me questions in the comment box, and uh, I'll either type them back to you or make a video. If you have any other ideas of videos you want me to do, um, let me know. Anyways, I hope to talk to you all soon. I miss you all very much, and I'm glad to be back. Take care now. Bye.